Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be calling pre-foreclosures again, um, but we're going to try it in the evening at 7.08 right now. So let's see if we can pull any opportunities. I already have the dialer going. And again, we pull these leads straight from the county. Um, I was already dialing earlier, actually. But uh, but yeah, the objective and the goal is to just have as many quality conversations. Miller Virgil Skinner. Sorry, I'm unable to take your call. Please leave me a voicemail and I'll return it as soon as possible. Hey, good evening. My name is Fabian. I'm looking for the homeowner of a uh, Virgil lane uh, yeah my brother and i just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to see if we consider an offer uh call me back uh to this number at any time appreciate it so yeah the idea is just have quality conversations pull those famous uh four pillars from uh, brent daniels which is your reason which in this case we already know it's a pre-foreclosure but we still want to ask hey so mr seller mrs seller all right we got a call coming in so, you know, have you, have you talked to the bank or where you at with the process? You know, you still want to know if, if they're talking to the lender, maybe they're trying to work on modification, maybe they're trying to, you know, work it out or figure out how they can come up with the money, but still ask. We already know the, the reason, the motivation, but we still ask. Um, the voice mailbox that has not been set like up yet. Voicemail. That's actually a... Goodbye. Voicemail full. Yeah, and pillar number two, so the first one was the reason. Number two um, would be condition. So somebody tells you, what's your offer? I don't like throwing an offer unless I know the condition. And, and, and I hit them back up with so. So I'm assuming you didn't buy it, you know, without looking at it, you know, back when you bought it in, in, in 2018, 2021, whatever the case is. And normally they're going to be like, no, you're right. I had to look at it. And same thing. I mean, you're not going to buy a car without test driving it. So make sure you don't throw just random offers because you're just going to lose. You're going to lose every time by throwing random ass offers. Work on, on getting the condition. Um, that way you know exactly, you know, what, what your numbers are going to be, what that rehab is going to be. Um, third is your, is your timeline. So, again, we know it's a, it's a foreclosure. We know there's an auction date. And, but still ask, hey, so, you know, we can make it a win-win. Um, by when are you looking to close? I mean, obviously, we're trying to avoid that auction, but maybe they need 30 days to move out, 60 days. Maybe it's a big family. Maybe they're elderly. Maybe you got to help them out with, you know, a uh, moving truck. You never know the situation unless you ask. And that's our job to ask and, and provide as much value as possible to these homeowners. Um, and then pillar number four would be your price. And again, I don't throw numbers out until I get at least three out of the four pillars. Um, the first three. Um, the person you're trying to reach is not available. Person. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi, Chris. You know, my name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property on Street. Uh, yeah, my brother and I are just buying in the area and just reaching out to see if we consider an offer on it. Um, you can call me back to this number at any time. Appreciate it. Left voicemail. So, yeah, on these voicemails, you don't want to sound robotic. Um, you know, just be yourself. Um, let's see, left voicemail. Just be yourself and, 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 you know, in my case, my brother and I are actually looking to buy in that area. So, yeah, throw little things like that because you don't want to sound robotic. You don't want to sound like a big company. System 832. One is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hey, Jorge, my name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property on... I uh, just want to see uh, if you consider selling. Uh, my brother and I are buying, bu are buying in the area, and I'm uh, just calling homeowners to see if, if they consider an offer on it. Buenas, mi nombre es Fabián. Jorge, estoy hablando sobre su propiedad. Si le interesa vender, me puede hablar para atrás a ese número a cualquier hora. Muchas gracias. So I threw a little Spanish in there, all a little fucked up, but, you know, they'll, <laughs> they'll get the point. So we're going to left voicemail. Left voicemail, no... Name on voicemail. So yeah, back to pillar number four, um, your condition. I don't like throwing offers unless, I mean, the price. Pillar number four is a price. I don't like throwing a price unless, you know, we know the condition, timeline, and everything else. But if they're adamant and they don't want to give you a number, they don't have a number in mind, throw a range. See how they react. You know, if you throw a range, they're like, oh, you're way off. I want retail. Well, 
boom, right there. We know they want retail, but you just want to see how they react um, and try, you know, I try my best for them to give me a number. But worst case, like I said, I always throw a range um, once I, I, I capture those other three pillars. Um, and again, those are your uh, your reason, your condition, your timeline and the price um, for the property. So, yeah, so it's 714 right now. We're still dialing. Um, like I said, the goal is to just find an opportunity that we can rec that we can create um into maybe a 20 30 40 50 k payday um in the same time providing as much value value to to these homeowners and and do our best possible to help them avoid you know a foreclosure on their credit um and you're gonna come across properties where you know there's no equity and maybe your cash offer doesn't work and what you want to do with those is is get creative you know if if you don't know subject to if you don't know seller finance um, well, in this case, be subject to because there's a lender. If you don't know subject to, you know, get it with somebody that that, that no know, know subject to. You know, in our case, when there's somebody with no equity. Please leave your message for. Sorry, we got a voicemail. Hey, Cesar, how you doing? My name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property. On, uh, my brother and I just buying in the area and just calling homeowners, see if they consider selling. You can call me back to this number at any time. Appreciate it. So yeah, subject to, you know, these homeowners, sometimes they owe a little bit more than when what the property is worth. To voicemail. The person you're oh, trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hey, Paolo. Uh, my name is Fabian. Good evening. I'm calling about your property. And uh, my brother and I are just buying properties in the 078 area and just calling homeowners to see if they consider selling. You can call me back to this number at any time. Appreciate it. Yeah, so as I was saying, you know, some of these some of these homeowners they owe a little bit more than what the property is worth. The you know the back payments, you know, they're backed up pretty much. Um, pretty they're pretty behind on, on their back payments, and uh, you know they can't sell it. You know, traditional route, you know, cash route. They can't list it. So another thing we do is is what we call subject to subject to the existing mortgage. So we essentially come in, reinstate the loan, so that you know they avoid them foreclosure on their credit. And we're going to simply just step into their shoes and continue the payment. So we've done a lot of those. And uh, you'll see that a lot with pre-foreclosures pre just because your arrears are so high. Um, payoff is, is close to what the property is worth. So not all the time. Um, but, yeah, most most times we have to come in and, and get creative if the cash offer doesn't work. Um, or if anything doesn't work, you know, last route is, is like I said, reinstating the loan and then just coming in and, and taking over the payments. And it's a beautiful thing, you know, buying a property like that just because, you know, we don't have to go get the loan. The loan's already in place. We don't have to go to the bank. Can't take your call now. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, simply hang up or press the pound key for further options. Hey, Gilberto, how you doing? My name is Fabian. Uh, my brother and I are buying properties in the area and just calling about your property. On Consider selling it. Um, you can call me back to this number at any time. Appreciate it. So I fucked up that voicemail. And again, don't be scared to mess it up. I mean, sound human. I mean, we're going to mess it up. We're going to mess it up. I've, I've been doing this for a long time, and I still stutter. I still fuck it up. I still say some shit that don't make sense sometimes, and it's okay. We're human, so don't let that stop you. My voicemail, no name, my voice. Oh my god, what the hell am I writing? I think I'm gonna give it to about eight o'clock. I think the dialer shuts off at eight o'clock. I'm not sure, but I mean, we'll just keep going until they tell us that we can't make any more cold calls. Um, but yeah, if you're starting off, I mean. Don't I know it's hard. There's a lot of information out there, but just keep it simple. Just try to have quality. The person you're trying to reach is Sorry, not available the at the tone. Please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. 
Hey, Michael, how you doing? My name is Fabian. I'm coming by your property. I'm, uh, my brother and I just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to homeowners to see if they consider selling it. Um, feel free to call me back to this number at any time. Thank you and God bless. What through the God bless in there? My voice. So yeah, like what, what, like I was saying, you know, if you're if you're starting off, you know, this can get a little bit, you know, scary. You know, people cussing you out, people just hanging up on you, and it's hard to to accept the rejection. But once you can get over that obstacle, once you can just make the calls and and understand that it's a metrics game, it's a numbers game, and it doesn't matter if they cuss me out, it doesn't matter any of that. I mean, I've been cussed out, I've been you know, threatening, I've been told crazy shit. But at the end of the day, if I can help somebody and make money in the same time. I mean that's 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 the goal. That's the win-win for everybody. So think about it that way. I mean, what's a no gonna do? What's a what's a fuck you gonna do? What's a hang up gonna do? Nothing. Hello. Hello. Yes. Um. Hi. I'm looking for uh, Mariano. Yes. This is not Mariana. You know, I don't know why people are calling me about a foreclosure. This is not Mariana's number. Oh. Like. Yeah. They're they're probably calling you about a property on on. Yeah, which I have no idea about. So, no, I'm not Mariana. I don't have any property for foreclosure. I, you know, that, that, so please j just delete my number. Yes, ma'am. I'll make sure on our end to, to remove your number. By any chance, do you have any property you, you're looking to sell? No. No? All righty. Well, I appreciate it either way, and you have a good evening. Thank you. Bye-bye. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. So, wrong number, and... um. Even if it's a wrong number, you always want to ask the follow-up question. Do you have anything for sale? Because you never know who's on the other line. It could be another investor. It could be somebody with, you know, um, a rental they're trying to get rid of or eat, or a property they inherited. Maybe they're going through a divorce. You just never know. Um, so, shit, I lost track. So, yeah, I have um, ADHD, whatever the fuck y'all call it. My mind goes everywhere. Um, but... Um, but yeah, I do my best. Every time I get a call, I forget what the hell I was saying. Hello? Hello? Um, yes, I'm looking for Alfredo. I guess that's not Alfredo Fuentes. So I guess I'm going to say wrong number. Can't get to the phone right now. Please leave a message. Hi, Ashley. Good evening. My name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property on May. Uh, my brother and I are just buying properties in the area, and uh, we're just reaching out to homeowners to see if they'd be interested in selling. Uh, you can call me back uh, to this number at any time. I appreciate it, and have a blessed evening. So the voicemails. I'm going to copy this. Why the fuck am I writing it? All right. So, yeah, for everybody, anybody starting out, pre-foreclosures um, is the most targeted list just because it's free. You can pull it from the county. Um, Weeple Harris, Galveston, Montgomery, Brazoria, all of, the, all of our surrounding um, counties. But, yeah, you can do this, especially starting off. Um, you can always purchase the list. I mean, if you have the 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 funds. Auto pause activated. What the hell? If you have the funds to do so, you can always purchase the list. But you know, the fastest way would be straight from the counter. Put your message after the tone. Simply hang up when done. Or for delivery options, press the pound sign. Hi, Deshondra. Good evening. My name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property on. Um, so my brother and I are just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to homeowners if they consider selling. Uh, feel free to call me back to this number at any time. Appreciate it and God bless. So left voicemail, boom. So yeah, we're pre foreclosures. Like I said, you can always buy a list, but we pull them from the county. We have a little system set up. It's it's pretty easy to do. Um, and yeah, another another one is driving for dollars. So if you're starting off pre foreclosures in my in my opinion, pre foreclosures, driving for dollar, and agent outreach. Hello? 
Hello. Yes, hi. Uh, good evening. I'm looking for... Who is this? Uh, my name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property on Road. It's not available. It's not available. Uh, any interest in selling nope. at all? No. All righty then. Well, I really appreciate your time either way. Thank you. Bye. Uh-huh. Thank you. Okay, so... We got the right homeowner. Um, so, correct... Homeowner, homeowner, what the fuck am I saying? Homeowner, not interested in selling. So I'm still going to push it, even though they said no. It's still a, a, a pre-foreclosure. Now, we don't know if, if, if they're trying to reinstate it. We don't know if they're trying to work it out with the bank. I mean, we don't know. Just because they say they're not interested in selling doesn't mean they're not interested next week or in a few days because anything can change um, with someone's life. So we're going to push it as a cold. And so it, when I push it as a cold, it's going to go straight into our CRM system, which we use Podio. And that's going to allow me to follow up with these pre-foreclosures. Let's see, auction dates in February. Um, so it's coming up. So I'll probably follow up again in, a, in the next, uh, it's Wednesday today, by Friday or maybe over the weekend. And uh, maybe ask the question, hey, so did you stop, you know, the foreclosure? Um, did you talk to the bank? Are they, you know, are they helping you out? Or, or where are you at with the process? Because a lot of people, you know, they say no, but they really haven't figured it out. And it's crazy. It's it's most people um, leave their situation, especially with pre-foreclosures to the last minute. They'd be calling the bank in the last three days, the last four days. And it's really tough to stop a foreclosure. Is it possible? Yes, you can stop a foreclosure even the day of, you know, they, they auction them off here in, in, in Texas at 10 a.m. Um and we stop we stop foreclosures at the day of you know the auction, but you know I don't like you know that much stress and calling the trustee and and uh, figuring out everything last minute. You know I like a little bit of days. It gives me enough time to do my due diligence and figure out if you know if it's gonna be a good deal or not. So yeah, if y'all got this far in this video and and y'all have any questions, you know drop them down in the in the comments. Uh, appreciate a like. Um, if you need anybody else, you know, starting off in this information or, or this video, you know, can help them, please share it. Um, but yeah, drop your comments. You know, my goal is to help you get your first deal and, and not just your first deal, many deals. And uh, hopefully we can, you know, collaborate together and meet y'all. Um, so, yeah, that's that's the goal with this channel. Just help whoever's starting and whether you're new or or. or your season i'm always learning myself i'm always a student of the game so don't always think you know that you know everything we don't i mean there's always going to be somebody out there better than than ourselves so um always just be a student of the game and be learning i'd, I'd be going to you know networking events or or just talk to other people and i get a little nugget here and there and i implement it in in, in my business um and so just just always you know keep an eye out keep a lookout for that kind of stuff so still dialing um, nobody else has picked up Let me cancel this one. and we like I said we're we're using a dialer here we're using batch dialer but if you're starting off it's not necessary at all to, to use a dialer you can simply just uh, have your phone Sarah Tank Services. I can't get your call right now, but leave a quick message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thanks and have a blessed day. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hi, good evening. Uh, my name is Fabian. I don't know if I have the right number, but I'm looking for Daniel, um, property owner of a brother and I just pur purchasing properties in the area and just reaching out to homeowners see if we, uh, they'd be interested in selling feel free to call me back or text me to this number mm -hmm. appreciate it and god bless so yeah like what's, what i was saying is you don't need a dialer to start you don't need anything other than the hustle the grit and uh oh and having a why you're doing this and your phone i mean you can simply drive for dollars get properties you know, whether you're in a bike, you're driving for a dollar, um, pick them up, skip trace them, call them. Pre-foreclosure leads, like I mentioned, you can look up Harris, Galveston. You can pull them up uh, uh, on the county and uh, 
get the records there. So, yeah. Voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi, John. Good evening. My name is Fabian. I'm calling you about your property. On uh, my brother and I are buying properties in the own area and just reaching out to homeowners see if there's any interest in selling feel free to call me back at any at any time appreciate it and have a blessed evening so yeah don't limit yourself oh i need the software i need this i need that you don't need anything other than your cell phone wi-fi go to starbucks get some wi-fi for free get a coffee for a dollar fifty sit down all day and just fucking make calls like I said, my top three are pre foreclosures just because the motivation is already there. Driving for dollar. Um, and I love driving for dollar because because not a lot of not, if you go through through a neighborhood and maybe somebody else didn't go through. I mean, you're probably the only one that has that that um, property. So driving for dollar is a must, regardless if you're new or you're or you've been the person this, you're trying to reach is not available at the tone. Please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi, good evening, Dino. My, no, my name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property. On, um, my brother and I are buying properties in the area and just reaching out to homeowners to see if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at any time. Appreciate it and God bless. So, yeah, driving for dollars. So, pre foreclosure is driving for dollar. And the last one, I don't think I've talked about it, is, is agent outreach. So, reaching out to agents. And uh, just being straight up, hey, I'm a, I'm a wholesaler, I'm an investor, um, however you want to approach them, you know, I'm looking for, hello? Please leave your message for 832-58. Hey, Herbert, good evening. My name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property. On, um, Yeah, my brother and I are buying properties out there and just reaching out to homeowners, see if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at any time. Appreciate it and have a blessed evening. Yeah, so reaching out to real estate agents, it's free. You can just Google and just look up real estate agents in your area and just hit them up. Like, hey, uh, this is what I'm doing. Do you have any pocket listings? Pocket listings meaning, you know, stuff that's not on market. And uh, build relationships. Um, you know, tell them, hey, you know, maybe you can cut them 50-50 on the assignment or some kind of some kind of split. And, and uh, I don't know, make it a win-win for them. And um, just be on top, on top of them and build rapport. And eventually, you know, hopefully they send you, you know, properties. Um, like I said, you're looking for pocket listings, properties that are not that are not listed. Um, but yeah, my top three ways, like I said, are pre foreclosures, Ryan for dollars, and agent outreach. So if you're starting off, those three ways, I mean, they really won't cost you any money. And like I said, all you need is your cell phone, some Wi-Fi, and some hustle. Forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hola, buenas tardes, Ramiro. Mi nombre es Fabián. Le estoy hablando sobre la propiedad que tienen. Eh, nomás quería ver si le interesaba en vender. Eh, mi hermano y yo estamos comprando casas en, la, en el área. Y me, eh, si está interesado, me puede hablar a cualquier tiempo este número. Gracias y pase buena tarde. Damn, I was forgetting my Spanish here. We've been doing, let me see, it's just 24 minutes barely. Feels like a long ass time. So that's another thing when you're cold calling this shit gets depressing so um find something to do play video games uh, do some other while you're dialing and having the dialer in the background i mean you can be uh looking for other types of leads or posting on facebook or, or being proactive don't just stare at the dialer like right now I'm, I'm i'm writing a script for another video i'm gonna do um while i have the dialer going so yeah don't feel like you just have to be stuck to the dialer and looking at the screen i mean the other stuff um get preoccupied that way it doesn't get boring, you know, because it's just you're just sitting here dialing. And that's where a lot of people kind of give up. They just get bored or, or 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 they don't find any opportunities in a day or two. I mean, this shit takes time. It took me, I believe, seven, eight months to get my first deal. Message system seven, one, three, five. Not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hey, good evening, Juan. My name is Fabian. I'm calling you about your property.
Yes, yeah, so my brother and I are buying properties out in the 086 area and just reaching out to homeowners, seeing if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at this number anytime. Thank you. God bless. Hi, I'm a Google virtual assistant recording this call for the person you're trying to reach before. One three eight five is full and cannot accept new messages at this time. Please try again later. Goodbye. Okay, so we've had at least one pickup, correct homeowner. A lot of voicemail, so hopefully, you know, we get some calls back um, later on tonight or tomorrow. But you always leave voicemails. I know a lot of people don't leave voicemails. I don't know why. The voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi, good evening, Blanca. My name is Fabian. I'm calling you about your property on... Uh, my brother and I are just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to a homeowner to see if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back to this number at any time. Thank you and have a blessed evening. And if y'all need contracts, assignment contracts, any of this stuff, if y'all close to getting a deal, uh, give all that for free. Just go to, I believe my link tree is on, on my bio. Um, just go in there and just download all the contracts and, and it's all, all the ones that I use currently. And if y'all need a good title company, I mean, I can always, uh, we use one Envision title in, in Clear Lake. I'd be happy to uh, go in person and see y'all can meet. Hello? Please leave your message for 8322. Two. Hi, Maria. Good, uh, good evening. My name is Fabian. I'm calling you about your property on... Uh, my brother and I just buying properties in the 047 area and uh, just calling homeowners see if there's any interest in selling you can call me back at this number anytime thank you and have a blessed evening please leave a message and I'll get back to you as soon as possible to voicemail the person you're trying to reach is not available at the tone please record your message when you have finished recording you may hang up hey juan good evening my name is fabian i'm calling about your property on um yeah my brother and i just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to see if you had any interest in selling feel free to call me back at this number anytime thank you and god bless Please leave your message for 832. Hi, good evening, Larry. My name is Fabian. I'm calling you pro about your property uh, out there. Uh, my brother and I are buying properties in the area and just reaching out to homeowners to see if you had any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back to this number at any time. Thank you and have a blessed evening. I couldn't say the street name, so I just... I figure I said the city, Kailua, Kailua, I don't know, I don't fuck it up. Help you. Uh, yes, I am looking for uh, Maria. The what? Hi, good evening, I'm looking for Maria Martinez. Uh, no. Uh, Maria, ¿te buscando Maria Martinez? No, no, ese es el nombre, el número equivocado, señor. Muchas disculpas. Bueno, gracias a usted. Ajá, uh -huh, gracias. And I'll switch it up to Spanish real quick. So wrong number. So I can see Batch Dialer has a script here on the side. I, I forgot it was there. So yeah, I, I normally don't use a script. Like I said, my goal is to extract the four pillars. 
and uh, you can do that real simply you know just start a conversation you just talk to these people like you're talking to you know somebody you know hey so what's going on hey so you know how can i help you you know have you you know have you are you talking to anybody are you talking to the bank have they been in any help what's your, what's your goal you know how can we make it a win-win just have a normal conversation you don't have to sound robotic and just don't think about the sales price and, and the money you're trying to make no go in there and truly 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 you know help these homeowners and provide as much value as possible and and if it's not a deal don't just lock shit up to lock shit up i see a lot of properties getting locked up at horrible numbers you know probably promising homeowners in foreclosure and pre-foreclosure you know that they're going to get a certain amount and i know damn right that they're they're, they're locked up super high and they're going to go back to the homeowner renegotiated or sometimes they even lose a deal and, and it goes through for two to auction so please leave your message for two eight one Evan. Hi, good evening, Melvin. My name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property. On um, yeah, my brother and I are buying properties out there, and I'm uh, just reaching out to homeowners to see if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at any time. Thank you, and God bless. Yeah, like what, like what I was saying. Uh, don't lock shit up. You know, just to lock shit up um and and that's happening a lot right now you know just be true to to them true to to the numbers if they don't make sense it don't make sense Neil, the person you're trying to reach is not available at the tone please record your message when you have finished recording you may hang up hi good evening felipe my name is fabian i'm calling about your property on um, so yeah my brother and i are buying properties out in the seventh area and just reaching out to see if you had any interest in selling feel free to call me back at any time thank you and god bless voicemail the person you're trying to reach is not available at the tone please record your message when you have finished recording you may hang up hi Lonnie. good evening my name is fabian i'm calling about your property on uh, my brother and I are just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to homeowners to see if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at any time. Thank you and have a blessed evening. I hope I'm even recording. It says I'm recording, but last time I went like a whole hour and nothing recorded. So let's hope it's recording. And yeah, drop those questions. Um, I'm here to answer and just you know provide as much help as possible and also i'm going to be doing a q a live on youtube i'm trying to pick a day whether it's saturday or sunday y'all tell me what day works best um or what day would you know would be best but yeah just go in there i'm gonna go live and i'm just gonna answer questions whatever people drop in i'm gonna answer you know regarding wholesaling subject to creative finance in general um systems just everything if you have a question just ask it so yeah most likely i'll probably do i'm aiming for saturday or sunday i don't know but i'll put it on the community tab um it's gonna be one of those days um maybe either in the morning or in the afternoon i don't know i'm gonna figure it out to see what works best gotta see with the rest of my schedule but i am gonna go live on youtube at least once a week and just answering questions voice message system Clyde ridgeway is not available at the tone nope. So I'm listening to the voicemail and I see here it says Margaret and the voicemail is not Margaret. So I'm going to assume it's a wrong number. Please leave your message for. Hi, good evening, Sergio. My name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property on. Um, yeah, my brother and I are just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to see if you had any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at any time. Thank you. Auto pause activated. It's a voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi, good evening, Terrence. My name is Fabian. I'm calling you about your property on... 
Uh, my brother and I are just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to homeowners to see if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at any time. Thank you and have a blessed evening. Call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi, Tamisha. Good evening. My name is Fabian. I'm calling you about your property on... Uh, my brother and I are just buying properties in the area and just reaching out to homeowners to see if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back um, at any time. Thank you and have a blessed evening. Message system 2. Not available. At the tone. Please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hi, good evening, Jamie. My name is Fabian. I'm calling about your property on... Um, yeah, my brother and I are just buying properties out there and uh, just reaching out to homeowners to see if there's any interest, interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at any time. Thank you and have a blessed evening. This is step away from my phone for a minute. Can you please leave a message or send me a text and I'll call you back or text you as soon as I can. All right. Thank you. Have a blessed day. Hey, how are you doing? My name is Fabian. Um, I'm calling you about your property. And uh, my brother and I are just buying properties out there in the area and just reaching out to homeowners to see if there's any interest in selling. Um, feel free to call me back at any time to this number. Thank you and have a blessed evening. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Hi Tyrone, good evening. My name is Fabian. I'm calling you about your property on car. Uh, my brother and I are just buying properties out there in the area and I'm just calling homeowners to see if there's any interest in selling. Feel free to call me back at any time. Thank you and have a blessed evening. Sorry, I'm not available to take your call right now. Leave your name, number, and a brief message and I'll... I am good. You may leave your number for the purpose of this call. I may re System four zero nine seven is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up or press. So I think we're going <clears> to <throat> call it a night, um, 8 p.m. Normally we go to 8.30, but I actually got another Zoom to hop on here in a bit. And so I got to get um, ready for that for, for one of my other businesses. Um, so, yeah, appreciate everybody, you know, stopping by, watching this video. Like I said, drop any 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 uh, questions y'all might have. Um, and the goal, like I said, is going to be to go live on YouTube at least once a week and, and do like a little Q&A. And I just want to do everything possible, um, provide as much value um, that I can and help you, you know, achieve and get that first deal under your belt. So, again, appreciate y'all watching. I'm Fabian, the paper flipper, and uh, I'll see you on the next one.